Hey, what is going on guys? My name is Engage Tutorials. Welcome back to another video and today I have an awesome glitch here for you today. Uh, it's a tutorial on how to duplicate personal vehicles for GTA Online. Now I know a lot of people have been wanting this so here it is. First thing you want to do is grab a personal vehicle that you want to duplicate and then set your spawn location to last location. It's under the online tab under options and you'll see it right there spawn location. Just go ahead and set that to last location so you can save yourself some time. Then what you want to do is head over to the airport and find a cargo bob. Now they're usually there. Um, if they're not, I'll show you where else you can go once we get there. But uh, just head over to the airport and see if the cargo bob is there. So the cargo bob was there for me. But if it's not there, you can go to your map and head over to this location over here. Towards this part of the map and there should be one there. If not, go back to the airport and wait for the cargo bob to spawn. Now guys, what you want to do is have a friend with you and have your friend get into the cargo bob. And then uh, make sure to tell him to send you an invite before you go through this. So before he lifts up and things like that, just tell him to send you an invite because you have to leave the game and come back. Alright guys, now what you pretty much want to do is have your friend grapple onto you with the cargo bob while you're in the air. Press start and then go to the Xbox Game Store and load up the Xbox Game Store completely. And if you don't know how to uh, release the grappling hook, you press right on the D-pad to release it. And then you can just attach it to any car you want to duplicate. And now once the Xbox Game Store has completely loaded, you want to go to your friend's invite that he just sent you and accept it and you'll be back in his game. And I would recommend not doing this at the airport because you spawn all the way back outside. And for some reason, someone is driving my duplicated car. I don't know why, but I got her out and uh, uh, just took off with it. But I guess it's they just put an NPC in there because uh, it's, like it's like a pedestrian's car. But as you can see... My personal vehicle is still on the map there, plus I have a duplicated one that is all smashed up from the cargo bob and some stun jumps I was doing. But there you go guys, there you have it. I have two entities uh, that were mine, that are mine, and you can sell the other one if you bought it after patch 1.08. And I hope you guys did enjoy this video. If you did, please leave a like, it would help me out tremendously. Let's try to push for 100 likes on this video. And if you're still watching to the end like you are right now, special word of the day for today is white put white in the comments if you're still watching and until next time guys take it easy and i will see you later